right, guys. This is a good afternoon instead of a good morning. We got a late start today, but today we are checking out the Lewisburg Cider Mill. As you can see over my right shoulder here. And this place is pretty awesome for the kids. All year long they got stuff to do here, but mostly this time of year because it's apple season. We're gonna go inside and see them actually turning these apples into cider if it be hot, cold, or frozen. And then it happens to be a day when all the school kids are here. Look at this place, it's busy. All these kids. So yeah, hopefully we'll get ahead of them before they begin to take over. Let's go check out the inside. That'll keep the dentist away. Just a couple of apples, right? So it's my understanding that it takes three different types of apples to reach the flavor in which Lewisburg Cider Mill puts out. So that's the, uh, the different colors are your different types of apples that are growing there. And this load came from what I understand to be Waverly, Kansas. And that's a little ways away. Maybe, uh, maybe an hour from here, maybe an hour and a half. It's uh, southwest of where I live, so pretty amazing stuff. Now the apples get to go in and they get pressed. So the Lewisburg Cider Mill is also known for Lost Trail root beers and sarsaparillas. They don't bottle them here, but they bottle them nearby. And that's something that you have to get. I mean, I know before I leave, I'll consume at least four of these for sure. But uh, if you're ever out here on Lewisburg on Highway 68, this is definitely a place to stop, especially if you have kids and things like that, because it's just a really nice place to visit for them. They got a little of everything you can try. There's Wesley screaming in the background. Oh, and maple syrup. That's another one that we love is real true maples. Uh, in this case, strawberries, blackberries, roasted pecans, all some of the best. Oh, here we go, here we go. Some donuts being made. guys I hope you enjoyed the Lewisburg cider mill nearly as much as we did it was actually a lucky day to be out here on a weekday and have events actually going on so we can go inside and see them make everything 
And if you haven't had it before, if you get out to the store and you can find it, get yourself some Lost Trail root beer. That would be one of my favorites. Oh, and you can't leave there without one of the 300 per hour cider donuts that they make from the uh, apple pulp when it's done with it. So they take that apple pulp and mix it up and make donuts out of it. Again, you can't miss that. It's a little hard to come by. We love them here at the house. That's uh, how we ended up getting donuts on Monday is because we ran out of these. It's kind of a special treat. It's the only time of year we usually get them is during the fall. Halloween around the corner and all the pumpkins, that's what I expect next. This goes back to needing to take that long walk. But anyway, if you guys enjoyed this, you like looking at the Lewisburg Cider Mill, we plan to do more trips like this and see other things in the area. Give us a like, subscribe, comment below if you enjoyed this or if you want to see other things similar to it. There's a lot in the area. And uh, ring that bell. We'd love to have you back in the future and hopefully you'll get to learn some more about this area. And who knows? We're a traveling family. I'm sure we'll be in your area next. For now, I gotta get back to work.